Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can validate a digital signature in Adobe uh, Acrobat a Reader. So let's get right into it. As you can see, I'm using the validating digital signatures page on the help forums for Adobe so you can check it out yourself. And uh, if you have any other questions, do check it out. I do insist. Uh, but yeah, uh, to uh, set preferences, you just need to go into the burger menu or the file menu and go into preferences and then under category, select signatures and from the verification box in the digital signature panel, select more. And then in the signature verification preferences, you can set automatic validation, uh, set verification uh, behaviors, check the revocation status of certificates, use expired timestamps, set the verification for time, add verification information, configure to trust the root certificates in Windows Certificate Store. And this is how it all looks like. Uh, you can click the verify signatures when the document is opened and this will do it automatically for you and i do recommend you do this however you can also uh well i'm sure you pretty much can't do it manually so this is pretty much it there is uh this on how to validate the, the digital digital signature and you need to set your signature verification preferences first then you open up the pdf and select the signature then the signature validation status box uh, describes the validity of the signature and for more information uh, on the signature and timestamp you can select uh, the signature properties in the signature properties you need to review the validity summary which is this date time and which is from the clock on the signer's computer the signature will be timestamped uh, and is timestamped uh, but the timestamp can't be verified and signature is timestamped but the, the timestamp has expired uh, which is all something that uh, can appear once you verify it and for details about the signer certificate, such as trust settings or legal restrictions of the signature, you can select show signer certificate in the signature properties dialog box. And that is pretty much it. And that's how you verify everything. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I hope you guys got everything that I uh, explained. And I'll be seeing you guys in another video.